temple of God mentioned in the prophecy of 2 Thessalonians 2.4 has nothing to do with Judaism or its defunct rites. The temple of God mentioned in end times prophecy is not a rebuilt temple of Jerusalem or a Jewish temple, for that would not be the temple of God at all, but the temple of a false religion. Rather, the temple of God mentioned in New Testament end times prophecy is St. Peter's Basilica in the Vatican. This is covered in detail in our videos called The Temple of God in Prophecy is Not Jewish and the exact location of the end times temple of God. End times prophecies have been fulfilled at that very spot, St. Peter's Basilica in the Vatican, in our day in stunning detail as our material covers. It was from that temple and the Vatican that events occurred which led to the taking away and removal of the sacrifice of the Mass from most of the world and its replacement with the abominable new Mass during the prophesied post-Vatican II apostasy. The Temple of God in the end times has nothing to do with Judaism but everything to do with Catholicism. That's because the Catholic faith is the one true faith of Jesus Christ, outside of which there is no salvation. There is no building in Protestantism that could possibly be considered a universal temple. But there is such a building in Catholicism, St. Peter's Basilica in the Vatican, built on the very tomb of St. Peter, the Prince of the Apostles, the one to whom Jesus Christ entrusted his entire flock and gave the keys to the kingdom of heaven. St. Peter's Basilica has also officially been called the Temple. It is the Temple of God, and prophecies have been fulfilled there in our day as our material shows. Catholicism has the Temple of God because Catholicism is true and biblical Christianity, while Protestantism is not. 